An investigation is underway into the deaths of three teenage boys killed when a car ploughed into them as they were walking to a party. Flowers have been laid at the scene in West London where the collision happened yesterday evening. Police have arrested a 28-year-old man who was in the car. From the scene, Olivia Kinsley reports. For a few minutes this afternoon, police closed the road where the crash happened for friends and family to say goodbye to three clearly much-loved boys. They're said to have been walking to a 16th birthday party just a few hundred metres away when the crash happened. Within like two minutes, that's when the ambulances started to arrive and the boys started to unload the ambulance of everything that was in there, first aid kits, everything. A boy came and stood because I was in a car in the passenger seat, I had the window down. He was standing next to me on the pavement and he was on the phone to, I think it was his mum or his dad, saying, oh, my friends are dead, he was crying, he, like, he couldn't even speak because he was so upset. This photograph is believed to show the vehicle involved, which police have confirmed was a black Audi A5. They arrested a 28-year-old man, but say another man was reportedly also in the vehicle. This is a busy, fast-moving road, and the boys were walking past the bus stop, which is on a slight bend. Police markings suggest that the car mounted the curb, travelled around 60 metres along the pavement, and then crashed into a lamppost and a wall. A security guard who works nearby told us it's a dangerous road. I mean, people just drive like lunatics, you know. Bad weather, good weather, they don't care, they just... They take that 60 mile an hour speed limit to the extreme. After releasing the balloons, the crowd held a minute's silence. This is a time when they will need one another's support. Olivia Kinsley, ITV News, Hayes.